Virginia Association of Broadcasters. One month from today, former delegate Phil Hamilton will walk out of a Pennsylvania federal prison. He has spent nearly the last eight years behind bars convicted of bribery and extortion. In an interview you'll see only on 10, Andy Fox sat down with Hamilton's chief supporter, his daughter, to talk about what's next for her father. Former Newport News delegate Phil Hamilton checked into a federal prison September 19, 2011. Guess what? He's getting out of prison in one month, and no one's happier about that than his daughter Meredith. There's never been a day where I felt ashamed to be a Hamilton, ashamed to be his daughter, never. And that's why I've been able to do what I've done. Because I have no doubt he would have done exactly the same for me. Meredith Archer always believed in her father's innocence, even though a jury convicted Hamilton for soliciting ODU for a paid position in exchange for submitting legislation for that position. I've always had this intense pride in the fact that he's my dad because I know, I know what he's done and I know what he didn't do. Meredith is also schooled now in the ways of federal prisons. The focus is not on rehabilitation. And she's disappointed with the federal prison bureaucracy. He could have been home uh, sometime in April. That the system has failed to quickly calculate when Hamilton should be released to home confinement. I think 210 days is way more time than was needed. I think 90 days is you more time. You and I time. sat down and figured it out like in 30 seconds. Yeah. I mean, just from the right. pure, raw numbers. This is the room where my dad will be. A picture of Hamilton's parents no longer living won't be far away. Their son is coming home. And on this table, a Virginia driver's manual for Phil Hamilton, who needs to go get his driver's license again. Meredith hopes that this will be his new home in one month and not a halfway house. The details on that still to be worked out. In York County, Andy Fox, telling your side.